Hey everyone, how's it going? In this video, I'm going to try to make thumbnails for your Roblox games, how to make Roblox game thumbnails, which is really easy. Right now, I'm going to be using this Line Runner game template right here. I'm going to go ahead and select this whole platform, and I'm going to use this for the thumbnail, actually. So I'm going to go ahead and just select it all. I could have just selected the whole folder. I didn't realize that. I'm going to go ahead and duplicate it and group it together, anchor it and all that great stuff, and put it together, name it thumbnail. All right, after that, I'm going to take it away from the base plate so you don't really see it anywhere in the thumbnail. Make sure this have a whole clearing area. And from the toolbox, I'm going to use the noob. It's just because it can and everyone relates to the noob everyone knows what the noob looks like so i'm gonna go ahead and just shape it around make it look like this one noobs has failed completely and died and then i'm gonna make them a little bit bigger just for the thumbnail no one's gonna really notice the difference and then i'm gonna make the other noob look like he's jumping successfully across the spikes on top of them and reaching for that coin right there and i'm gonna make sure to do a little bit of adjustments put them all in the same group so i can delete them all after i'm done or just save it for another time if i want to use it again for like a game icon which i could do that in another video i was playing with a different skybox but i'm gonna keep this one so originally i was gonna do it from the 2d perspective but i actually want to do it more like this this actually looks really good so i'm gonna go ahead and use this close up the other tabs and go ahead and get a screenshot of that snip that i'm gonna go into paint.net which i'll leave a link to in the description below if you want to go and download it for free i use this for many years now i'm gonna go ahead and find out what the size of the thumbnail should be so for example you can just search up the roblox game thumbnail ratio or template and you can find it like this or you can copy a thumbnail from a roblox game on the platform and that should be correct size but i think i don't really like the idea of copying a thumbnail i'm going to go ahead and get the actual ratio that you should be using to so go ahead and just search it up roblox game thumbnail ratio and then i'm going to go ahead and take a part of the screenshot that i took and keep a good part of it i'm going to go ahead and copy that over and paste it over onto the actual thumbnail ratio that you want to fit into i'm going to go ahead and make it bigger so this actually took me quite a bit of time i spent like 10 minutes actually making this thumbnail which isn't bad i'm going to use TechScraft, which i'll put a link to in the description below as well i'm going to make a logo for the game for this example the game's called noob jumpers go ahead and copy this and bring it over it's going to be completely transparent and it usually should be and i was playing around where i should put it it was an overlay i put on top of this thumbnail they added the logo now i'm doing the lighting with the glow effect and then adding a little bit of a focus here and actually i think it turned out pretty good especially for like a starter thumbnail which is completely free to make everything i used in this video is completely free to use and it should be in most cases i'm going to add a little bit of a like you know effect like oh do you have a motion like oh my god i just died you get the idea i'm going to go ahead and save it after finishing the thumbnail but it is pretty easy to make and I'm pretty much showing you how to make it step by step here. After that, you want to go to your Roblox game. You want to add the thumbnail too. Go to Creator Hub, go to Creations, and go ahead and pick a game. I'm going to use the new game all the way to the right. Click on that. And from here, actually, I think you want to go ahead and view on Roblox. I know they're moving things around still and it gets confusing, but you want to do configure this place after three dots. Now, here's the game icon, which we're going to be covering in another video here soon, which will be a link in the description below once I made that video. Now, for thumbnails, we're going to go to do image, which is completely free. Go ahead and upload the image, which is the thumbnail, add the thumbnail, and submit it. Now, to select it from your file explorer, and put it in there as you can see it's right here and you can actually add alternate text so people can see more text or context to the image if you want to add it i suggest you can or you should do it actually because why not so i had to come up with something can you beat the levels and noob jumpers i didn't really know what to put there but you get the idea so you get what's going on in the thumbnail but that's how you make game thumbnails for your roblox games on roblox i hope you found this extremely helpful if you did subscribe to the channel smash the like button and join the roblox group it helps me out a ton link in the description along with all the other stuff i used in this video and goodbye